Hey guys, welcome to Half Throttle. I live in Springville, Utah now, and today I'm going to ride from Springville to Provo. And I could do that in about five minutes, but today we're going on an adventure, and that means taking the long way. I just came up Hobble Creek Canyon, that's where I am now, and I don't know if you can see that sign or not, but it says Pull Heaven on it. If you come up here and you ask someone where Pull Heaven Road is, they will say, do you mean Pull Haven? Because that's how all of us dumb rednecks in Utah pronounce that word, even though it plainly says Pull Heaven. Anyways, this road becomes uh, Squaw Peak Road, and you can drive up through the mountains all the way to Provo Canyon from here. So it's a pretty cool ride, and, and uh, we can't just drive to Provo the easy way because it's too hot. We have to go up in the mountains and get where the air is a little bit cooler. So let's rock and roll. We're pirates, banditos, and beach bums. They piss us, tequila, sweet rum. Raise the colors, damn the dog drums. Anchors away, hey. Manana, you may find us crooning. Manana, maybe we'll be swooning. Manana, gazing at the moon in the sky above the sea. There's no urgency, certainly no emergency. Looks like we're fresh out of anxiety. Blow your worries away. Manana, you may find us boozing. Manana, guess who busted their engine open and has leaked out all of their oil? right this guy so I'm gonna try to coast as far as I can oh guess guess who else didn't bring their cell phone also this guy so I'm gonna coast as far as I can and see how close I can get to civilization hey guys um, I'm still cruising down the trail had a little bit of a problem. Have you ever heard me mention how uh, I regret it every time I take this motorcycle off-road? This is oil and it has all dripped out of my motor and uh, there's no oil left inside and that's a bad thing, okay? Having no oil in your motor is what we call bad. Oh. There's a little window, that should have oil in it. There is none because it's on the ground. Because I hit a teeny tiny rock with this $6,000 skid plate that I got from Touratech. And it, I don't know where it's leaking from, but it has busted my engine wide open. So, I've been coasting for a while now. Been coasting down this, oh, that's dirty. Um, I've been coasting as far as I can, but now uh, the road is flat, so I'm gonna push for a while. <sighs> Couldn't find my cell phone, so I thought, oh hell with it. I've driven this road many times. What could happen? So uh, now I'm gonna push my 500 pound motorcycle the rest of the way off of this mountain because I can't call a friend to come get me. Even if I could, I don't, what are we going to do, you know? Um, it's too big to put in the back of a truck, so here we go. Now I do have one of those spot emergency beacons, but I, I do have one of those spot emergency beacons, but because I'm not injured, I don't really want to use it because... <laughs> The bad thing about those things is you can send a message saying that you need help. And I kind of told people that I would only use it if I was hurt and couldn't continue on my own. So since I'm not hurt, 
I'll just uh, see what I can do before I have to use that as a last resort. Well guys, uh, I I finally I found somebody with a phone that who let me borrow it and I called my brother and he's coming with the truck to uh, pick me up. It's a truck that has a lift gate so we can just wheel it on there and put it in the truck and get it out of here. So that's sweet that uh, I've got a truck like that on call. My family's business has a, has a big truck like that. So uh, I'm just gonna hang here. He was having trouble, uh, like I was having trouble give, getting him directions. So I said, I'm gonna activate this. The thing I hate about this is uh, that this button sends out a message that says, you know, I need help. And you, you have to pre-type that when you're on the internet before you leave you've got to type something like you know whatever I think mine damn it these flies mine says um, I'm injured and I can't continue any farther so please come save me but I'm not injured I just I just need help so I guess if you can call somebody and say I'm not really hurt but this is where I am then you can hit this button or something like that the problem is you you give several email addresses so it's just emailed a couple of my friends and they don't, I wasn't able to call them. So they may show up, we'll see. But uh, I'm just gonna hang here until, this, uh, until somebody gets here. Um, I don't know what happened down there. I don't. I didn't seem like I hit anything very hard, but obviously I, I, I must have hard, hard enough to bust the shit right out of that oil pan so I don't know what's wrong with it but I know I can't afford to fix it so this might be the last video for a while